Hey guys, so welcome back to Fitness Infinity and in this video we will be talking about overtraining. Is overtraining a myth? Is overtraining actually exist? And uh, how would you know that you are suffering from overtraining? So let's start. So guys, you are working out in a gym, right? You are working out anywhere. How would you know? How would you know that you are suffering with overtraining? So first of all, let me tell you, overtraining is not a myth. You will find so many people talking about it's a myth. Only lazy people talk about overtraining. You should train uh, your best every single day. But overtraining is not a myth. It do exist. As the researchers has been made, proven scientifically by sports sciences, that overtraining do exist and it doesn't happen overnight. And this is the most important thing. Which you have to in this video. Which I am going to tell you. That one night, or two nights, or three nights, you can't do overtraining. Nahi kar sakte. What I mean with this sentence that one day or two days or three days you have done workout gym you have done heavy workout you are sore next day you are in legs you are not able to do steps you are not able to do your hands you are not able to do you are having pain in your neck you have a little bit of soreness in your scapula right your rhomboids are not functioning very well you are feeling a bit of you know congestedness in your body right so most of you guys been suffering from like two to three days you must have done some heavy workout and you've been feeling you've been uh, you've been experiencing uh, the pain the soreness in your biceps while contracting in your trapezius right uh, in your clavicle part you must be like feeling so much pain in your deltoids and uh, serratus muscles so all these soreness are not the symbol of overtraining all right Overtraining do not exist in two to three days. It won't be happening to you in an overnight. So what I'm telling you, if you are facing any kind of issues, like in two days or in three days, if you're suffering from pain, then you must have done some kind of exercises wrong. Apne galat tarikhe se exercise kiya, apne properly stretch nahi kiya, apke muscle tendons, fibers properly stretch nahi huye workout ke pehle you have put a lot of force on those muscles and now you are suffering pain so that is not called overtraining so this overtraining syndrome occurs in competitive athletes who are preparing for competition working out every single day for months aur us training regime se wo recover nahi kar pa rahe they having frequent illness, changes in mood, degrading of their performance. Unka jo performance jo hai field pe, wo dhere dhere kam hota ja raha hai. So ye saare factors tells you about overtraining. So overtraining exists in competitive athletes who are working day and night for months, not like two to three days. Like we are working out in gym or whatever type of workout we do, we don't suffer from overtraining. Make sure you stretch before and after your workouts. Lift heavy. Lift as much as you can. But make sure your form, your posture should be good. And you won't be a victim of overtraining. That's it. Done.